So Cicely started her career in January of 2012 at the Calgary Health Trust, and she remains at the Calgary Health Trust today as the Acting Director of Development and Campaigns. Cicely is so involved in volunteerism with in the fundraising professional. She has um, dedicated a lot of time to the AFP Calgary and Elk area chapter as the um, co-chair of the Generosity of Spirit as well as the director of Hope Worldwide. The current diagnosis for um, lung cancer is, is 45 days. Um, for me to get a diagnosis for breast cancer, it was 11 days. When you think of of how that is gonna change diagnosis and treatment and, and everything else, like that is, impactful. It's saving lives. I'd say one of the things that we get to do is um, bring some of the best to Calgary faster. I went to a, a talk where a physician was speaking about the new um, hybrid operating room that we had in Calgary for cardiac care and he gave an example of two stories of you know fathers on their way home from work to pick up their son to go to either hockey or another event um, one father not making it because in the operating room in the old version it was like an open heart surgery and many things need to happen at once and in the new operating room in the hybrid operating room um, they could do all those many things at once they could go in intravenously there's there's lots of different things that they can do and just the difference in the outcome the story for that patient and that family at the end of the day that one dad went home whereas the other one didn't when I get to do my job I'm usually bringing a donor what I get to do is give them that behind the scenes tour. I get to help them see things that they hopefully will never have to see, but if they do, they get to know that the very best care is available for them. And, and it's because of the donors that are coming on these tours and making these gifts that the next person is going to have that best care. Well, I grew up in Regina, Saskatchewan, so uh, I have two brothers and a sister, and um, we, I don't know, lived in. What to say that? Um, I don't know. Lived in a single family home for most of my, my childhood. Um, well, I don't know. I think it was just persevere or keep moving forward. So I think, you know, supporting families in need is important. Um, and same with my family, like my kids. It's really important to me that they understand that other kids have less than they do. And so um, in my job, it's really important for me to make sure that they understand that. Really, I feel like I take a back seat. Um, it's the other people who are being honored, the, the donors that are going to also be honored on this day. They're the real change makers. I'm just helping facilitate it.